Hello everyone, here we are in the Nam Yentse Sansi exploration. New little uh, bit that came out today. Exploration. So, popped in here, and let's see what's going on. Jake says, guess deserts are hot no matter what world you find yourself on. Bring some unpleasant memories back. Why is that? What happened? You don't remember? Then it's best forgotten. Actually, I'm not sure what he's referring to. I don't remember myself. But right off the bat, Urton Flower, grand worth uh, right there. Able to get two grand in uh, Urton Flowers here. Now, pretty straightforward from what I've seen of the items. They're all kind of where you would expect things to be hidden as usual. <clears throat> over in corners um, and they seem to have a preference to left sometimes so there we go another flower now from what I've heard of the boss he's actually not too difficult and that's all relative depending on your team of course how far you are in the game but wow just dropping bosses here Okay, that was unexpected. Dropping plates. I'm dropping plates. Alright, well, uh, he is the boss I'm talking about, uh, the Uratan Eater. He is weak to wind. So you got a nice little boon there. Um, and very strong to earth. 300% defense, so I'm wondering if he actually uh, absorbs Earth then. Uh, kind of curious on that. Immune to all status ailments, gravity death, immune to attack, defense, magic, and spirit break. Um, technically, all you got to watch out for is uh, he's got brutal physical damage attack. Um... And he buffs his defense by 100%, so you can always dispel that. Fairly easy to kill in one turn. Um, yeah, that's about uh, all the info so far. That's uh, really all the info you really need, honestly. Whoa, where'd I go? There we go. Get a mage, mage masher, which uh, I'm wondering if that will silence. Usually that's what the mage mage masher is for, is silence. Echo herbs. Wow, I'm just dropping this, these boss fights right out in the open for everyone to see. Um, fill up the LB gauge because that's one of the requirements here. Quest requirements. Defeat with a limit burst. No escapes. Party of five or less. And of course completing the quest which is kind of uh, redundant. You'd have to complete the quest to do what's going on there obviously. I have to drop us over here. Pretty interesting area. I don't remember uh, Final Fantasy 12. Well, I do actually. And I was going to say I don't remember it that well, but I actually I do very well because it was very interesting the fight mechanics. Uh, you set up your attacks. It was very cool and interesting. And some of those boss fights are ridiculously time consuming. Um, but the graphics don't compare to the graphics here, so it would be really difficult to match it up through memory. Get ourselves a Turbo Ether. Let's see. Next 
item is right on over here. I can't believe they dropped four of those uh, Yensas. They are just tossing them at us. What can we do? That's less work for us. Is that enough damage? No. Less uh, draw on the MP of uh, old Freyva there. Such a low MP on my uh, friend Freva. Surprising. Alright, so right behind this little uh, tower is a fight. <laughs> I'll just throw a fight at you right there. No, that's probably random, I would imagine. Gotta make sure I don't uh, use that again in a repeat, but uh, refill some MP there. What? 1%? Oh, wow. You're gonna try and knock out my characters, huh? Is that a requirement? No. Okay, good. <laughs> Holy crud. That's mean. Too late to use those items, but that's okay. <laughs> the way, uh, I didn't see what Soleil looks like. She was kind of, wow, it's brutal. Um, the way poor, what's his name, looks, uh, Onion Knight looks when he's knocked out is pretty funny. Poor guy. All right. Yeah, that was definitely unexpected. Um, Alright, let's move on to the next item. Right over here, number seven. What are you doing here? And we got... I was going to say, that's really not enough damage? Wow. So many groups of these things, it's ridiculous. Definitely, in the, and it's ridiculous towards my MP. Definitely going to need more here in a little bit. It's looking like already. Alright, so item number eight. We just got Turbo Ethers. It's supposed to be a flower here. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, item number eight. Shielded armor. Well, technically your armor should be sh shielded, but not shielded, shielded. Never mind. <laughs> Let's go with an Osmos Blade, one of my favorite things about Freva. Love uh, any character with Osmos. Come on, do it. Drop these things. Wow. Alright, now I gotta be careful here. How hard is that gonna hit me? Hard enough. Alright, jerk face. What a jerk face. What a rude. Um, what am I dropping here? Phoenix down. Now, I, I never tried, uh, Hidden Cure with Person Dead. Uh, I always recast it, so... I'm kind of curious. I'm thinking it doesn't, uh, cure... That what that one person I would imagine. Not taking any chances. 
could have waited until Onion Knight was finished, but let's just slap him anyways. So, like I said, shouldn't be too hard, relatively speaking. Um, it all depends on who and what you bring in here. Item number nine will be right over here in the corner there, hidden. Well, let's go and find our tenth item in this cave. Right there, hidden behind, we get a War Gods band. All right, let's, uh, I'm wondering. Hmm, I'm actually curious what those are. I'll drop them in the, in, to here, or in the uh, description, actually. These aren't too hard to knock out, but then again, nothing is guaranteed here, it seems like. And even if they survive, I can use uh, Meditate, one of my favorite reasons for having Delita, besides the 70% single target uh, defense or spirit break. When he's, uh, well, upgraded Delita, not uh, Night Delita. Regular Delita. Alright, item number 10 is up here in the corner. Cypress Pile. And, or no, that's item number 11 actually, our 11th item. Now we gotta drop these guys. Let's go with the Schwert Dance. Schwert Dance. Ah, crud. It's gonna hit the same character, same enemy. No, actually hidden in for an enemy is beautiful. I like that. I will take that. Now comes the fun part. That was the last item to be found. So we come to a boss with 4 million HP, so... Oh, uh, just so everyone's clear, you can't uh, fight the boss and then go and look for items afterwards. You know, beating the boss here as uh, it ends the exploration, just as it has in the other Vortex, recent Vortex uh, explorations. Now, the fun part comes... Chaos Grenade. Let's hit a Schwert Dance. Actually, no. Panzer Dance off the beginning. Boost our defense. Gonna drop some Frost Flower on him. And Weakness to Wind. So, let's boost our Earth Resistance as well. Let's drop a Chaos Grenade. Could have tried to combo the Chaos Grenade, but too late. It's only five grand in damage. All right, let's, let's get some of this going. Don't think gonna destroy him in one turn. Unfortunately, it does not look like that's possible. Chaos grenade was useless, actually. Forget the chaos grenade because, well, he's immune to breaks. So I forgot about that. Uh, let's boost our magic and spirit. Now we put ourselves in a problem. Pain in my butt. Actually, cannon dance, reduce spirit.
that doesn't help. He's got, see, and he's got his defense up. This is, uh, I'm thinking definitely the wrong way here. Uh, so they, that's good boost in attack and magic, but otherwise, not really helping me out here. Alright, good. I'll take that. Now. Meditate is up. Meditate was up. I don't think it's up on Freya. Uh, what can we do with her now? We can boost our defense and spirit, of course. Okay. I'm wondering. Hopefully this wouldn't drop him. Boost our defense and spirit. So many great things that Delight is not actually used for, for at the moment. Don't need an LB gauge. Everybody's full. Yeah, that's going to knock him out. So let's hit this. Uh... Ooh, it didn't knock him out. Not even close. Well, better safe than sorry. Trying to get an LB kill here. Limit burst. No escape. Party 5 or less. I can drop the Lida. I don't mind. Put up your protect. Drop the Lida. I could put up an earthen wall here. Since we're good in all the other respects. Now, unless we get under 10%, whoa, 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 whoa. let's drop this anyways. Don't think there's enough damage to Freyva's limit burst, though. She's been, I've been upping it, uh, yeah, definitely not yet. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a rough one, isn't it? Alright, good. Hit. No. Oh, it's gonna be another one of these. What do I get for the limit burst? Earth resistance plus 20%. Yeah, let's forget about that for the time being. Next time I'll come in here and get that. Time to take you out. Boom. What? Come on, there we go. Oh, phew. Alright, take him out. I'm not gonna lose like last time. <laughs> that was pretty funny. I remember that it's pretty well. Don't remember the boss, but I remember the, the situation and laughing pretty hard at it. Uh, so. The new icon for Final Fantasy Brave Exodus uh, on your computer or whatever you use, uh, emulator, looks to be Sakura, I'm guessing. So. Didn't mean to skip that quickly, but uh, if you want to read it, go ahead and pause it. I'm wondering, actually, if I should leave if I should leave those in like that, or I should try and skip them at a relatively fast pace, or if I should be reading them out loud. Let me know how you feel about that. Let's get our 10% trust, or 2-5% trust moogles here. Get a 10 grand in flowers, get a Vega Plus. And I'll come back for Earth Resistance. Now. Leave it in the description. What uh, those items do. Alright. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. 
and hopefully you had a better time with that boss than I did. That was the hard version, uh, not the easy version. Have a good one.